Amazing Grace is another person's fast food toy story. Yay! Amazing Grace is another person's fast food toy story. Yay! Yay! Amazing Grace is another person's fast food toy story. Yay! Yay! Hello, what's up guys? My name is Percy and I'm the Guinness World Record holder for the largest collection of fast food toys. <laughs> yeah, baby. Okay, so uh, I'm here once again to tell you another amazing and stupendous and own inspiring Percy's fast food toy story. And so for today, boy have I got a toy for you. <laughs> okay, our toy for today is none other than Yum and his multi tools. Okay, this is from the series of toys called School Pals, Jelly School Pals. Now, I cannot figure out as to what year this was actually given away, but most probably it was released by Jollibee um, as part of their opening school uh, promo. You know, they're providing the kids with some school pals here, and uh, so probably June of 2019 or 2018. <laughs> okay, uh, I was trying to peruse through the packaging, but I couldn't find the year this was actually released. Okay, but suffice it to say that it was released by Jollibee uh, probably early June or uh, May. 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 <laughs> okay, now let's open it up. This School Pals and this is Young uh, Multi Tools. Okay, let's open it up. Wow. Let's open it up by think <laughs> our, our sister is beginning to go. Carpet. Okay, let's open it up. Dun, da, da, dun. Okay, it comes with the base here. <laughs> Seems like a mechanical base with some designs of some nuts and bolts there. And then uh, we have the image of Yum looking very spiffy, <laughs> ready for the school year. Okay, unfortunately. Uh, this year, I think they would have to delay the opening of the school year because of the COVID-19. Well, uh, I'm hoping that uh, eventually uh, this problem will be heard of. Um, this uh, problem will uh, just, yeah, just be solved so that um, we can bring back a semblance of normalcy, especially for kids who are, you know, I don't think they can even enjoy the summer vacation. <laughs> Uh, they simply have to stay home to be quarantined so as to, to lessen uh, the adverse effect of uh, the COVID-19. Okay, so this is uh, it. This is Young getting ready for school. And then uh, this is the base and there are some pegs here. And I think we can put uh, Young over here. Yeah, with some special made uh, holes at the bottom of the feet. And it can fit snugly on the image of Yum. Okay, now there is this uh, contraption here that you can you can roll out, and it will actually spin out Yum. Wow, this is great. Okay, now what what is this supposed to be? <laughs> Aside from the fact that you can rotate Yum in this base, there is also some mechanism at the bottom. What is at the bottom? Hold on a second, I'm trying to... Ooh, at the bottom, we have <laughs> this uh, accessory. It's a school supplies accessory. I think it's a ruler. Okay, it's a foldable ruler. Or it can actually be a compass, especially if you want to uh, draw some uh, really perfect circles, you can do so. Or a half circle, just like this one. <laughs> These are perfect. These are early introductions to the compass and uh, the ruler also. And then, aside from this, I think we have other surprises underneath the... Uh, how do we pull them out? Okay. Oh boy. I'm really having a hard time trying to pull out the... Or, does this pull out? There, okay. 
Aside from that compass, there is also this embossed image of Yum. So what you do is some, put some paper here and then you actually color it uh, to actually reveal the face of uh, Yum in your paper. And that's a neat uh, accessories, uh, especially if you're such a fan of, of Yum. And then uh, there's another piece here. Okay. <laughs> wow, this is pretty awesome. For those of you who are really interested about the solar system, about planets, you can actually have this a particular pattern to draw a uh, Saturn, okay, or some smaller planets like, uh, yeah, Pluto. Is it still a planet? <laughs> okay, there's a crescent moon. Uh, a half moon or there it is this stars uh, the moon <laughs> and all sorts of comets and planets here <laughs> so you can basically use this as a pattern especially if you're uh, a neophyte when it comes to drawing i think uh, these uh, uh, accessories the school supplies can actually be uh, very beneficial to jumpstart your artistic skills. <laughs> I mean, it pays to have uh, something like this. Uh, some sort of, uh, this is uh, comparable to uh, riding a bike with all those extra wheels on the side, especially if you're really not yet used to biking. So this would somehow help us in trying to yeah jumpstart our training as future artists. <laughs> okay, these are pretty awesome. Okay. So now uh, you have your compass here, the ruler, and then some additional artistic work accessories. I think you're all set up for school. You simply just need to buy a couple of notebooks, some pad papers, some pencils, and uh, ball pens, and a lot of coloring stuff, <laughs> and uh, a good bag, a pencil case, and I think you're all set for school. <laughs> and uh, what a way to start a school than to have Yum here to help you out with your schoolwork and to inspire you uh, to become better in your school. <laughs> okay, so I must say this is just an amazing grace. So once again guys, let's try to be thankful to God for all the amazing uh, grace that come into our lives within the form of a young multi-tools from a series of uh, toys called School Pals from Jollibee. <laughs> An amazing toy and a great addition to my person's past toys uh, collection and also be thankful for you know those wonderful first day of school experiences I know it's a little bit nerve-wracking to to begin the school year especially if you're new to your school and you have a lot of new classmates but the whole experience is actually very awesome especially once you get to, to know all of these uh, wonderful people these new classmates and then uh, being introduced to a new teacher who might be so cool to actually inspire you to learn so much more in the school <laughs> or basically guys let's be thankful for every amazing grace be they small or big be they seemingly insignificant or the truly thankful ones or just about every amazing grace that make our lives a lot more happy and jolly and I thank you guys for always tuning in to First is Pass with Toys. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, yeah, uh, thank you to the new subscribers. Please keep them coming because we still have a lot more First is Pass with Toys story up my sleeves. So until the next First is Pass with Toys story, bye bye. I'll see you.